हेलो फ्रेंड कैसे हैं आप लोग आई होप आप सभी लोग बहुत अच्छे से रहेंगे आई एम रियली सॉरी कंटिन्यू हम वीडियो नहीं बना पा रहे हैं आप लोगों के लिए बट अब हम कोशिश करेंगे कि रेगुलर बेसिस आपको वीडियो मिलता रहेगा और ये सेशन जो है ये एक लाइव सेशन है और इस लाइव सेशन में हम स्पेशली विंडो सर्वर टू पे ट्रेनिंग दे रहे हैं किसी कंपनी के लिए ट्रेनिंग है तो इसके इसका जो मेन मेन टॉपिक है इसमें इसका एक प्लेलिस्ट रहेगा विंडो सर्वर 2022 का तो आज से प्लेलिस्ट शुरू हो जाएगा और वन बाय वन जैसे सेशन होता रहेगा इसको हम प्ले में ऐड करते रहेंगे अपलोड करते रहेंगे और ये सेशन शुरू करने से पहले आपसे एक छोटी सी रिक्वेस्ट है कि मेरे चैनल पे अगर आप नए हैं चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करके बेल आइकन को जरूर प्रेस करिए तभी आपको नोटिफिकेशन मिलेगा तो चलिए बिना देर के सेशन को शुरू कर दें सो गाइस वेलकम टू माय ऑनलाइन सेशन एंड इन दिस स्पेशली इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न विंडो सर्वर 2022 एंड विंडो सर्वर 2022 अबाउट फीचर्स एंड द एडवांटेज डिसएडवांटेज एंड द ऑल अबाउट विंडो सर्वर 2022 वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वन बाय वन रोल्स एंड फीचर्स एंड अगेन आई वुड लाइक टू टेल यू 2022 इफ यू कंपेयर बिटवीन विंडो सर्वर 2022 2019 एंड 2016 सो यू माइट नॉट यू मे नॉट गेट मच मोर डिफरेंसेस बिटवीन सम रोल्स एंड फीचर्स विल बी एक्स्ट्रा you can get in 2022 server that's all and other than uh, like domain controllers uh, root domain controller additional domain controller child domain controller or read only domain controller these all stuff are same as same even uh, the file system for this particular server operating system is a same like previous version of server operating system like uh, fat 32 ntfs and refs so same file system in this okay so uh, one by one will uh, be discussing about these all features about and services roles right so in this session especially uh, just i am going to install the windows server 2022 and if you have uh, your personal laptop or desktop and you want to practice yourself so you can just download windows server 2022 easily you can download by um, open the google browser and just you type windows server 2022 download trial and just you download trial version okay then only you will able to uh, get access for 120 days trial so i am not going to give any link at all in this video description because you guys are already are working and you are professional so i hope you can download and you can do it that easily even installation portion also you will be knowing just you have curiosity to know about windows server 2022 how to install and how to configure so therefore i decided to uh, take the session uh, especially otherwise you can do this uh, yourself there is no differences at all uh, compared to a previous version of windows server uh, editions right so anyway uh, i have downloaded uh, windows server 2022 trial version and i am going to install okay so let's start uh, first uh, see uh, these all session uh, first i would like to uh, tell you the sessions i am going to take uh, i am going to uh, use lab in my workstation 11 that is old version of workstation latest version uh, i have not updated this because if you update so Uh, you have to update window as well so therefore i have not updated this uh, workstation otherwise i have latest version workstation as well but i am explaining in workstation uh, 11.0 that is the uh, more comfortable for me and uh, it's not for you uh, that depend upon you if you have uh, like window 11 on your uh, laptop 
and you can go for latest workstation you can practice or else uh, instead of uh, workstation you can have uh, oracle box or any resources to practice this okay so let's uh, create the virtual machine I am going to create a virtual machine uh, where I am going to install the Windows Server 2022 so just you click here to create a virtual machine and uh, uh, let it be this typical and next I will install the operating system later because I have to add the image and here Microsoft window and here uh, the differences is uh, old version and new version uh, workstation here I may not get Windows Server 2022 uh, because this is latest one here I can get it only Windows Server 2022 okay so no problem you just selected Windows Server 2022 and uh, move next and uh, here whatever the server name you want to give in your top of your workstation that will be mentioned so that you can give just I'll give your name server 1 because in uh, coming session we need many server like 3 4 servers so therefore I am giving server 1 this is first machine okay and the location we are going to store this uh, image like this machine what machine I am creating right now this will be uh, storing in a place in your hard disk drive right so that depend by default uh, if you don't give any such location so by default it's going to store in the system drive where you you have installed your operating system in this machine and the particular folder my document right in document uh, virtual machine and in the machine in the folder virtual machine folder the particular server name which I have given here that will be stored okay so everything in this particular folder is going to store like virtual hard disk drive virtual machine and all the stuff whatever we are going to do in this particular machine everything will be storing in this such location so before installing if you are installing in your laptop or desktop anywhere so before installing you have to decide whether you where you are placing the place whether is a compatible or not uh, means the particular drive should have a specific space otherwise uh, you may get error or uh, else uh, later your machine will be slow okay so enough space required for that because this uh, windows server 2022 itself required at least at least at least 40 gb of hard disk drive so if you have such a space like 40 uh, 100 gb up to 100 gb in any drive c drive d drive or e drive so you can give uh, C drive if you have more than 100 GB then let it be by default otherwise you can give different location you have option here to give different location like just you click on browse and you can choose your location where this particular machine will be placed okay so I am not giving any location let it be by default where is going is going to C drive alright particular location and uh, in future if I don't need I will delete this okay so just click here next and the size of hard disk I am giving uh, here 80 GB 60 GB, GB is just recommended just I am giving 80 GB and let it be uh, nothing we, we have to select here and next and customize hardware where you can change your RAM size like by default is uh, you can see uh, it's optimized uh, 2 GB but it's not enough to install the Windows Server 2022 uh, if you want to work fastly so you need to have at least 4 GB RAM for this right so just I would give here 4 GB RAM 4096 it is right so manually you can give otherwise you can uh, give here like this okay and see automatic it will uh, reach on 4 here right and uh, 
here you can see the networking uh, bridge uh, because uh, what is the function of bridge see guys i am not explaining more about the vmware workstation because if you need to learn vmware workstation if you don't have much idea so don't worry about i have uh, uploaded a video for vmware workstation full tutorial everything where i have explained about bridge net and iso image how to add and how to take snapshot each and every stuff i have explained in that so don't worry about the particular video link i will uh, paste in this particular video description okay so you can find it and here uh, 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 cd and dvd image i have to add the iso image because i am installing workstation so iso or nrg here so let's go to the browse and i have restored my image for windows server 2022 it's e drive and icnt gyan folder and here i have downloaded so here i have uh, here this is the iso uh, see i have downloaded 2019 as well as 2022 so the same image okay and close uh, size guys you are asking about the size uh, um, it's about 6 gb uh, let me check the size i haven't check i have downloaded the image size is around including folder i am checking see you can see so it's a uh, 5.16 uh, i told now 5 gb 5 gb plus any server uh, after like 2016 uh, you will get 5 gb plus okay so i have added all this and now let's start to install so how can you install let me check whether it's a recording or not my video yes yeah it's okay so i hope uh, you are listening and uh, you are my voice is audible right so let's just power on click power on your machine will start and i'll make it full screen and nothing else you will see now you will see and you will say it's the same like uh, windows 7 windows 10 and windows server 2008 2016 2019 as well as 2022 okay installation is nothing nothing different same like anyway hmm, of course remote installation can be done here uh, we can install the yes yes deployment services so we have session don't worry in coming session uh, we are going to deploy uh, automation right WDS window deployment services uh, yes yes we can do so here you can see you can select here English India okay and next and install after that everything same 
so what i will do you know uh, just once initialize installation then i will pause the recording video and then we can have the discussion whatever you have doubt we can discuss okay hmm hmm i can understand your question see this is the addition here you can see uh, uh, in, uh, even you can see windows server 2022 uh, sorry 2012 2016 and uh, uh, 2000 uh, this 22 standard and data center only two editions we have and in this both edition you can see either you want to core installation core means only command line like here you can see standard edition means core edition core edition means only command line you can get some features only and you can use powershell and scripting you can do you can use as powershell okay means command line only and this is graphic environment you can see desktop so standard or data center so i'll prefer data center so just go to the data center and desktop means full installation okay so this desktop means cy as well as gy graphic mode you will get it so licensing if you talk about the licensing so you have two license okay windows server 2022 microsoft uh, announced one is a standard and uh, another is a data center and uh, in both edition there is no more more differences just less differences you'll get some less uh, feature differences also you'll get and price also same like uh, yes but if you uh, see command line means uh, core install core feature and uh, graphic feature so there is a more differences even pricing okay so in future we'll see um, we'll have discussion about the licensing okay so in that session we'll discuss about so just i'm selecting here data center gui edition okay desktop that is desktop environment and click just next here and this is license agreement so no need to, to read because this is trial version uh, but uh, in case of if you are working in company if you are installing in company then you have to go through this license agreement and then only go ahead okay and if you have any like uh, doubt or something you can send mail you will get reply by chat microsoft people or direct you can get uh, back by mail okay <laughs> trial version uh, we are not putting getting any rep, uh, any uh, response they are not giving any help they are not get, this is the difference between trial version and license version i think you will be knowing that you are working already you are professional so i should not discuss about this thing this is for a student <laughs> okay so just uh, click on next and upgrade here in further i don't know which uh, version of microsoft server microsoft going to announce so that will be uh, otherwise here what custom installation we need to go and um, i have chose 80 gb hard disk drive okay so you can let's check actually uh, this is first time i am installing myself as <laughs> well so just click new and we'll see how many uh, mb taking for system reserve partition so normally uh, 500 and 350 mb right in case of windows server 2022 here oh my god just 100 mb file is taking for system reserve file okay system reserve location so very less so advantage you can see here so you have to comment and <laughs> you have to uh, tell me about uh, whether this is advantage or disadvantage why microsoft has sync uh, sync actually the size for system reserve decrease the size like earlier version you can see windows server 2022 that is 350 mb okay okay so 100 mb and this is the, our system drive uh, that will become c drive and uh, i will just click next no need to farm it okay and just click next that's all 
so next it will be continuing okay take time around 20 to 25 minute and now I am I will pause the recording video and we'll have discussion so guys at last you can see uh, our server 2022 installed and uh, here just you give password for administrator so I will give common password password should be complexity that you know already right and yes that's finished done uh, now Graj Hindi guys Hindi is my mother tongue but actually I was told uh, initially for this session and this for this batch uh, I have to teach you guys only in English language so therefore otherwise I am much more comfortable to discuss and teach Hindi language so unfortunately I cannot so I am really sorry dear and if you have any doubt personally you can discuss anytime personally you can connect me on Skype or uh, Instagram WhatsApp we can have a discussion no problem okay so you can see our windows server 2022 uh, got installed okay and just log in sometime vmware is getting struck so don't worry just you press ctrl alt and insert ctrl alt insert button okay not delete delete if you press the base machine will be loud okay and here yeah. so final uh, desktop screen you can get it so that's all installation is uh, stuff and uh, this full screen you will not get uh, if you want to get full screen like normal your desktop environment so you have to install vmware tool and uh, um, i told you already i have made a video for the vmware workstation so i am going to uh, share the link of the video in this particular video description okay so you can uh, watch that because I cannot teach, uh, I cannot teach you, and I can, uh, we cannot have the session, especially session for VMware workstation in this. Okay, uh, so better you can watch that, and you will understand. So that's all you can see. is taking time of course will take time because uh, if you compare about features role and services so in windows server 2022 more features and more services than compare window earlier version okay so coming alt sessions all sessions will be recorded and uh, I will upload my YouTube channel ICNT Gyan so please subscribe my YouTube channel and I'll make a playlist for the particular session okay so each and every session um, uh, day by day how we are uh, conducting how we are finishing this uh, will be uploaded okay so you can in future whenever you have any doubt you will have any uh, confusion so you can watch the particular session each and every session device will be uploaded okay so guys you can see final screen and uh, this is our windows server 2022 screen okay and uh, now uh, if you talk about the services and then server role server manager dashboard will be 
here you can see server manager like windows server 2012 and 2016 2019 as well here so once it's initialized you can check the role and services so same like installation any services installation any roles and features everything same same nothing different only some more services you will get it okay so here you can see dashboard for windows server 2022 server manager dashboard and here you can see uh, manage tools everything okay so just go to the manage and add roles and features still is taking some time it's asking to connect network So that's all. Uh, I'm not going to install any roles and services in this uh, session. Installation that much, okay? And uh, let me show you about the uh, file system that is important. So disk uh, mg empty dot msc and Here, I will shrink the disk. You can see by default is a NTFS, okay, NTFS. And uh, you can create, you can see, just I would create a partition 5 GB. I want to show you how many partitions selecting here. How many partition file system is supporting like fat interface and I uh, see here I would create the partition and here you will get to know you can see right and here file system NTFS fat32 and REFS so same file system like earlier version of Windows so I am not going to create file system simply I wanted to show you that's all okay so uh, still is initialized or not let me check here uh, server manager yeah now it's initialized and next you go you can see here role and remote wait same like earlier version of windows server and uh, here you can see and these are the roles here one by one we can install it so almost all are same role same services okay so we'll be doing this okay uh, the property of windows server 2012 i want to show you a look Here you can see the configuration what I gave right for the particular virtual machine and uh, here you can see installation on uh, the detail right all the detail will be showing here you can see.
the module everything right Okay, so these are detail here. So guys, that's all. Okay.